Good afternoon, ED. Well, thank you so much for your time. This interview is solely based on that is the stadium renovations for um, our football um, games. Talking about just football in general, the Brave Warriors did um, win that is Cameroon by two goals to one, yes. one of their biggest achievements yet. Yes. Yes. And now, you know, just the public were just giving us just some of their views on it would have been different if the game was on home soil. So particularly, we're talking about now the, re the renovations of that is the independent stadium. So just yes. when will those renovations commence? All of us were very happy, but it was very unfortunate to see our boys playing on empty stadiums, as we've seen. And this is really a result of us not have done uh, quite a uh, good job in terms of uh, upgrading and renovating our stadium. Mm. Um, I'm sure there's a lot of interest, like you said, people are asking about when are you going to start with the renovation of independent stadium? Uh, the good news is that we finally got the facility audit report, the one we have been talking about. Mm -hmm. in, in that facility audit uh, report, uh, the document I have it here with me, I can show you, uh, it gives us now a good guidelines as to when to start. And as, as we said uh, in the past, that it's not only independent stadium in Venduk, but the one in Swakop Mundaswa and Oshakati. Mm -hmm. Those are the three we want to to. to, to, to to start with the renovation now. Is there any like um, anticipated cost of how much this um, renovations would cost? For okay, um, at, at this stage it's a bit difficult. As you know that last year we did the budget. There was a budget in the current financial year, which is ending this Friday. Mm. We had some, um, made some provision. It was around 50 million. And everybody was talking about that 50 million which we had. Mm. But at that time when we did that, it was just based on estimate. We were not 100% sure how much. It will cost us. But now, with this report, uh, the one I was referring to, the, from the facility audit, there's also cost uh, there. Between today and next week, we'll be able now to go into the detailed costing of it, of all of the three. But what I can assure you, uh, it will be more than what people think it is. Uh, 50 million, what we had, I think it will be more than that mm -hmm. for the three stadiums for us to make sure that they are up to standard. Uh, but how long do you think this process will take? Okay. Uh, as I said, since we got the report, I'm sure they also put in timelines. But what we want to do first as a ministry, we want first to, to do the quick ones in terms of us making sure that the team will start playing at home. So this, hopefully, we can do it within a period, depending now really on the cost, it might be less than 12 months. The first, I'm talking about not the first phase, because I'm sure we have to do it in phases. It, it's going to be a massive uh, project we need to carry out, and therefore I cannot really now say that We'll do it within a year, but I'm sure we'll try to make sure that we do it before 2027. For any last remarks to the nations who are actually crying out for this renovation to actually be faster? I just want to really to, to appeal to the public. I know that we, you know, they are frustrated. Mm -hmm. And for what we have seen yesterday, you know, for you, your own team playing you know, in, in, in a foreign country, an empty stadiums, mm -hmm. it's not good. It's not good for all of us, and that's why... I'm really appealing to, to the public, please be patient with us. I know it's, it's not a good thing to say, but I'm really asking for them to be patient with us. Finally, as I said, finally we are moving. Mm -hmm. We are moving, and uh, the good thing is that the Ministry of Finance has made already some provision already for us to start as tomorrow. You know, once we, as I said, once we read the, 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 the recommendation, most of the action will start happening right away. Well, Edie, all the best with the renovations of that is the stadium. And thank you so much for your time.